Come on, boys. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Hurry. Whew. It's Christmas. Christmas. The little guys can't stay out in the cold very long. They go out and they go right back in. The big guys on the other hand are out here. Chevy, you done? Diesel, you done? Hey bud, you done? No? Come on, let's go inside. It's almost time to open presents. Come on. Christmas breakfast. You ready? So excited. Christmas soup. Oh. oh chef. Go for it. Go for it. Don't hold back, guys. It's Christmas. You're allowed to overeat on Christmas a little bit. Speaking of breakfast. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I like to stick to the main food groups on Christmas Day. I claim that one, 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 and that one, and that one for good measure. Okay, so far. Merry Christmas, Commander.
No. No, you did it. That's just the box. <laughs> he has more? <laughs> I'm wondering if that's what you got. We were talking about it, then you got all excited when we were talking about it. And you kept saying how much I love my gift. Yeah. I'm excited! <laughs> awesome. <laughs> my second pair. And my t-shirt. Oh, you just cleared out my drawer at work, did you? Oh, you got me another one of these ones. Awesome, I was just thinking this morning, if I didn't get this, I was going to buy one when I got back to work. <laughs> That's awesome, thanks, B. I totally needed more clothes. <laughs> totally. Alex was very helpful. She always is. She told me that someone had got you the the scarf already. And it was Alex. And it was her. Alex got me the scarf. <laughs> Thanks, Alex, if you're watching. <laughs> Commander, was Santa good to you? What did he bring you? What is that? An extremely alarmed looking elf. He's mine. Don't even look at him. Don't even. Don't even think about it. Don't even think about looking at him. Diesel, what'd you get? I got a creepy elf. He's got sweet faces. <laughs> Wanna see? Let's see. Let's see, can I see him? It's a happy elf. It's a tired elf. And a... Displeased. Displeased elf. I was gonna say, a drunk elf? <laughs> Very possible also. <laughs> Too much eggnog. Too much eggnog. Diesel, don't wreck him though, okay? Don't wreck him. Wiener, what did you get? A very nervous Santa. He looks kind of angry, but that's okay. He matches my German spirit. I think he's, he's nervous. Oh, he's nervous. He's got the eyes. <laughs> Don't touch him. He's mine. <laughs> and we have one more down the hall over here. He went over here because he started wrecking his already. <laughs> so he took it over here so he could uh, dismember him in peace. Are you being nice? Are you being nice to your elf? What happened? What happened to his ear? What, what was this? He came like that. No, I don't think so. You be nice to your elf. <laughs> don't rip him up right away. At least let him last the whole day. It's only been 10 minutes. <laughs> it's Christmas. I got a PS4. <laughs> it's right there. I know, the, the PS5 just came out. But I don't want a PS5. And you can't really get it either because it's sold out everywhere. Well, at least it was on the first day. There was no way of getting one. Plus, I had already ordered that um, like two weeks before the PS5 came out because I knew I'd have no chance of getting the PS5. And yeah. I didn't want to spend $1,000 on yeah. one gift because then that's all he would have gotten. Mm -hmm. I knew he he would have said that was too much anyway, so. Yeah, I wasn't, I don't really need a PS5, I don't want one. I just wanted a PS4, because I have a PS3 right now, and I'm not that big of a gamer that I need all the latest stuff that just got released. I usually wait a few years till the next thing gets released, but. <laughs> Wiener, your toy is very crinkly. <laughs> it's funny, because she kept, like, being so pro-gaming. She was always <laughs> talking about how, oh, now when I go to work, you'll have time to, you know, do your gaming. I was like, what gaming? What do you mean I don't have time to do gaming? I guess I was trying to get you psyched, but I kind of gave it away and I'm usually, I usually don't do that, but oh well. It's funny because I was really hoping for a PS4. It is, it is what I was, it is what I really wanted. It's what I asked Santa for. PS4. <laughs> Santa always delivers. <laughs> so yeah, that's pretty cool. And the dog's got their presents. Yeah. Now we gotta do our stockings. Now we gotta do our stockings, yeah, yep. Yeah. Christmas. It's Christmas. This is Britt's new table and coloring book. She asked for a coloring book. I delivered. I like adult coloring books. They're therapeutic for me. And I needed a table so that my neck wouldn't be down so far all the time because I have a really bad neck. So this is awesome. It tilts and everything. I, I'd show you, but it's kind of. I've got carpal oh, tunnel. There we go. 
Isn't that oh, awesome? Nice. I love it. Let's try cool. it out. Let's see some of the pictures that you can color in there. Just pretty flowers. Ooh, that's like a Christmas wreath. I like that one. We're going to do that one today. Ooh, another wreath. So it wasn't the most complicated one. There are some really uh, intense ones. But... This I've was got on a, your list. I've got some complicated ones in that drawer. and I go through them very slowly. I've had them for years, and I've only done a couple pictures in each. Brand new coffee maker. Thanks to Brit's dad and stepmom, Jerry and Cynthia. You might notice the brand. That's some high quality coffee right there. So my sister Rose made this for us. I don't know how, but it's amazing. A lot of work goes put into that. That is awesome. Macrame, right? Yeah. Macrame. My sister Cheryl made this for us. Hand painted. Everything. Yep. I've been asking for this one for a while. His mom has it in her kitchen. So this is from his mom and dad. But it's reverse. So you but can Cheryl use it. made it. You can use it all year round. Mm -hmm. From mom and dad, Cheryl made it. I think it's probably gonna go where that snowman picture is. I like that. We should do that today. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's yeah, awesome. The snowman picture can just lean against something for now, or we can put a nail where we're going to put something else all year round. That's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. And there's and another the best one. Of all. This one here? <laughs> yeah. This was from Cheryl. She also made this. Hand painted again. Hand painted. It looks so real, like real flannel. It does. It's a great job. And then you flip it around and you can use it all year round. Beautiful. Home sweet home with paws. I don't know that I'm gonna, I'm not gonna put this outside until we build a house with a proper porch that it won't get yeah, wet. Yeah, I don't want that to get all or weathered. Or stolen. Mm -hmm. But so it's gonna be an inside decoration for the first few years. But isn't it gorgeous? I love it. That's awesome. Yeah. How did she reach the top? Ah, ah, cause she's short. Shorter than me. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> I'm gonna stay out of that one. I'm so, allowed to make short jokes because I'm short, but Cheryl's still shorter. So we got a lot of good things. Brett got me some uh, some nut butter. <laughs> that was before you came off the road. So if you guys want to know what nut butter is, Google it. <laughs> it's not. Good. <laughs> it sounds dirty. It's funny. And yeah, it was a it was a really good Christmas. I know this video wasn't uh, very long, but we just tried to enjoy the day the best we could with everything going on. Britt is already looking for a home for this. Well, because I don't want to put something to hang it with, because then we would have to have metal pieces on either side and have to drill into it and then risk splitting it. Oh yeah. So I'm thinking it could just sit up here until we're going to be getting rid of this ugly thing and getting a nice like butcher block counter pantry. Mm -hmm. for more counter space and then we're probably gonna do shelving and then we can put more decorative stuff so it can just go up here for now okay this is my poppycock that must be moved here into the overcrowded pantry eventually small house small everything mix oh where did this come from sabrina she was hiding this from me no it wasn't it was right out in the open you're taller than me you can see that stuff easier whatever i know where the fudge is the neighbor brought us homemade fudge Tricky. So good. That can be put away, I guess. Okay. What else do we got up there? This is just a... Is this your diary? Nope, my address. Not your di oh. I don't have a diary. I was going to go running away with it. My diary is on YouTube. Yes, it is. Oh, I'm worried this is going to fall. Mm, yeah, probably will. Because this thing is not anchored to the wall, thank goodness. You're going to have to put something heavy behind it in front of like a book stop on the sides or something. Two book stops would be nice on each side. You know what we could do? We could put it there if it's okay. not too long. And then we could just move that stuff over to here and just set it further back so it doesn't come flying off. Yeah, that'd probably be better. That stuff's a bit heavier. Let's see if it fits. I think that's longer than that shelf, though. Shoot. Ah, small house problems. The dilemma. 
Yes. We could always set up our new shelves that we have and then put that on the new shelf somewhere. Yeah, but I want those to come up here and we don't have the proper furniture for it yet. Mm. I don't know. I guess I could just go on our TV table for now. Yeah. So we took this off of there. She's going to put that there. Hopefully this doesn't fall over. Oof. It's just not very sturdy. Might have to push it right against the wall, like that whole sound bar and everything. I don't think we can. No, because there's too much stuff behind it. Maybe just the sound bar, not the whole table. Like just. All right, so that plan, that plan didn't work. We'll put this guy back there. This is also something Cheryl made. It can be used all year round. For now, until we find a permanent home for it, it'll just have to be in the corner there. We want it somewhere safe where it's not gonna fall, so. Until we figure out where we're putting all our shelves and stuff and other things. Yeah, we'll get around to the bedroom someday, hopefully. Yeah, we need a new bed in there. We're still sleeping on the floor like teenagers. We've always had a very college kid looking bedroom. I'd like to actually have like an adult married couple bedroom one day. One day, yeah. Next month, we're getting a, a new bed frame and mattress, hopefully. And uh, that'll make this room look like a, you know, a normal room. We can get new dressers and stuff. Slowly. Slowly but surely. Unlike uh, what some people say about us, we are not made of money. Though I wish I was. Man, wouldn't that be awesome? So that's it for this year's Christmas video. Let me know what you did for Christmas down below in the comment section what's your family traditions and were you still able to do them this year during this whole covid mess let us know down below have a merry christmas we'll see you next time